Hello everyone, welcome to another question and answer session. A 45 years old man sustains a significant head injury and a craniotomy is performed. The sigmoid sinus is bleeding profusely. Into which of the following structure does it drain? So after careful reading, so now find out the key point here. And you can see a 45 years old man sustains a significant head injury and craniotomy performed. Sigmoid sinus is bleeding profusely. We have to find out into which structure does it open. That means the sigmoid sinus drains which of the following vein. Here are the options. Options are internal jugular vein, eustachial sinus, petrosal sinus, inferior sagittal sinus, and external jugular vein. So first of all, let's see the venous sinuses in the brain. Here, first of all, we can see this is the superior sagittal sinus it is the longest sinus then we can see this is the inferior sagittal sinus and superior sagittal sinus it passes at the upper part of the fox cerebri and inferior sagittal sinus it passes through the inferior part of the fox cerebri then we can see the great cerebral vein then great cerebral vein and inferior sagittal sinus they form the straight sinus and state sinus comes to the confluence and here we can see there is the transverse sinus so uh, from confluence of this sinus there we can see this is the transverse sinus and through the transverse sinus then sigmoid sinus and sigmoid sinus drains in blood into the internal jugular vein so it is the normal pathway of the flow of the venous sinuses then in this picture you also can see the another view of the venous sinuses first of all this is the superior cerebral sinus where this is the inferior cerebral sinus and great cerebral vein or vein of gallen then here we can see this is the estrate sinus then confluence then we can see transverse sinus followed by the sigmoid sinus and this sigmoid sinus is draining to the internal jugular vein so by this process venous drain is occurred so we can see now that the sigmoid sinus it drains into the internal jugular vein so this point is important and our question they want to know the the sigmoid sinus drain into which vessel we can see this vessel is the internal jugular vein so here our answer is ready now that the internal jugular vein into the internal jugular vein the sigmoid sinus drains so on both side of the head there is the internal jugular vein and both side of the head there is the sigmoid sinus and this sigmoid sinus drains into the internal jugular vein and if here we can see the name of the veins are superior sagittal sinus inferior sagittal sinus estate sinus transverse sinus sigmoid sinus confluence of sinuses occipital sinus and cavernous sinus thank you all